Here, another review for you, but this time it's not the Bible, it's not a rebind, it is something really special that uh, I thought, uh, why not? I really have to see this. It's called Torah Portions, a guided notebook, and this is what it looks like. This is what sent to me for an honest review, and uh, I have to say, I'm impressed. The author of this is a 34 year old pastor. He's a husband, he's a father, a writer, designer, an interpreter. And uh, basically he wanted uh, uh, to give a tool for people to get deeper into the Word of God. And he started with the, the five books of Moses, also known as the Torah. And uh, he's following what we call in Messianic uh, Judaism, Messianic circles, uh, the Torah portions, which is what Jesus, Yeshua, uh, followed every Sabbath reading. Uh, for the God, for the, for God's scripture, and uh, this is a hard book, and it comes with this lovely uh, dust jacket, and uh, as you can see here, uh, you can uh, take it out or just leave it as it is. Uh, the book itself is nice, but I also like uh, the the core of it. Here's the ISBN, and uh, in the inside it says here, O Israel, Shema or Shema Israel. Uh, as part of uh, the design, I think is lovely. And uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna show you the book, the inside of it. I'm gonna take this off, leave it aside. It's a nice design, actually. I like it. It is a gray kind of uh, color uh, with a texture like a uh, fabric. Uh, I like it. It's uh, thin. It's uh, lightweight. Here it says total portions, not excellently done, the, the stamping, but the, you can read it, it's there. But the book looks and feels sturdy. I like the thickness of this paper. And on the presentation page, we have total portions notebook in English and in Hebrew. And uh, here uh, we got uh, John Diefenderfer, uh, is the author. He is the, this is printed in the United States. Here's the ISBN number. Okay, and I'm just going to leave this here for a few seconds for you to read. Okay, so about the Torah portions, as I can see here is the Parashat or Hashavua portion of the week, uh, which is basically uh, one portion per week of the, of the year to read through the five books of Moses. And uh, he tells you, you can stop it if you want to, to uh, give an introduction to this, this book. Now, how to use this notebook? I find it super interesting that uh, it doesn't only give you the, the, the tool or resources to, to study, but it gives you also a hint, it gives you like a guided line to, to know or how to go about it. And uh, I find this super, super, super uh, duper. I think this is great uh, for us that love the Word of God and we want to get deeper into it. So I just show you here, so even give you some samples and from Genesis, uh, how to go about it. Uh, and he gives you also here some uh, uh, hints or suggestions uh, so that you can get the best out of uh, each week's uh, reading. Uh, in this case, we're talking about Genesis, chapter 1, 2, 3, and 4, and so on. So, this is what it looks like. It gives you the title on top of it, uh, of each part of the Parashat or, or the portion of the week. Okay, and you got spaces for keywords, definitions, personal takeaways, uh, even you can add your own references and notes uh, for, for that specific uh, uh, portion. And here's like a little key, so you can use that too to help you out. Uh, for each uh, week, you want to have uh, these two pages. Here's for example another date, that would be uh, Yethro uh, or Yitro in, in Hebrew. 
and everything is like this Shemot or Exodus that's that's basically the the name in Hebrew and in English of each portion she seed Tazria I like this paper is very thick this book is very sturdy I I like the design I think uh, you're gonna love this if you enjoy uh, uh, doing these readings every week and at the end of the book we got a final review uh, future study and contemplation and a study conclusion and uh, on the back we have also a bit of a Hebrew reference guide for the letters so you can also learn a little bit of Hebrew as you study God's Word not only modern Hebrew or uh, but also the Paleo Hebrew the ancient Hebrew letters here's some information extra for you if you want to read I think this is a fantastic job I really like this and that's the end of the notebook with its uh, cover here well I think you're gonna enjoy this also there are plans on releasing more of this uh, uh, for other sections of the Bible in 2020 so that's all for today I hope to see you next time in another Bible review or rebind until then Shalom